In this video, we're going to demonstrate using Veritas eDiscovery platform to respond to a subject access request. In order to use eDiscovery platform to respond to a subject access request, we first of all need to create a new case. In this case, we'll name the case after the data subject in question, Eric Bennett. We'll also assign the type of case as a subject access request and assign the work to the compliance team. As we save the case, we now start creating the collections required to collect the necessary data sets for review. In this case, we're demonstrating collection from a variety of Exchange mailboxes. Once the mailboxes are added, we now add a secondary collection source of a file server, in fact, home shares on a file server. Now that we have the collection created and all the documents collected that we require, we can now enter review. And during the review phase, we can take use of the classification technology built into eDiscovery platform to filter on specific types of data. In this case, we're only filtering on data that contains the social security number. As we start to review the individual files, we enter preview mode to look at a rendition of the actual file itself. And in this case, we recognize the file itself contains sensitive information and so we apply redactions to the file and in fact all other files just like it within the review set. We then set the document as responsive, i.e. include in this subject access response and repeat for the remaining documents. Once we're finished, we simply run a search using that same SAR responsive tag to collect all the documents that are now in scope for production for this particular data subject. In this case, we select all those tags, all those documents, and then set a folder to which we'd like to export the final documents. Once the folder has been set, we now run an export task in order to dump those documents out to that folder in a common machine readable format. And here we can see the results of that particular run produced a whole series of TIFF images of all those documents page by page. And in fact, we can demonstrate by zooming in that all the redactions themselves were burned into the image files rather than simply being hidden. Once the production run is complete, this is the document set that can finally be returned to complete the subject access request. And any discovery platform the final phase is to simply set the case now as closed and finalized. And this date will be then saved within the system as a record of when the, the uh, case was first of all filed and opened and then finally closed. This concludes the demo.